Hi, my name is Councillor Josh Morgan and I'm standing here at the corner of Fanshawe Park Road and Allersbrook Gate because I want to talk to you about pedestrian safety. Uh, behind me are thousands and thousands of residential uh, homes. Uh, some are houses, some are apartments, some are duplexes, uh, thousands and thousands of homes. And in those homes are students, students who go to St. Andre Bissett uh, Catholic Secondary School, which is on this side of Fanshawe Park Road, a very busy road as you can see. One of the biggest concerns I had when I was elected councillor was the lack of a safe sidewalk connection from this community behind me to the school. Uh, when I investigated this, I found that the subdivision agreements, which were written many years ago, never contemplated a school being built uh, this early in a, in a developing subdivision, and thus the developers weren't required to put safe sidewalk connections all the way along. So, for a few years, students in this brand new high school had to walk along this road, on the roadway, sharing it with buses, cars, construction vehicles, traffic, not just in conditions like this, but through the winter, when drifting makes the road narrower and much more slippery. It was very unsafe. Uh, I took this up, uh, worked with the school community, worked with our staff, and worked with the area developers to try to come up with a solution to get these sidewalks in sooner uh, rather than later. Uh, Auburn really stepped up early on and built uh, the sidewalk on the east side of St. Andre Bassett, which connects uh, all the way along to Dal McGarry and then down to Fanshawe Park Road. And I'm very pleased to let you know that in time for this school year, which starts in just a few days, Southside Construction uh, and Development has stepped up and built this sidewalk on this side of, uh, of St. Andre Bassett, which connects up Aldersbrook Gate to Tacola Trail and down to St. Andre Bassett. Uh, without their help, without the community's help, without the school community's help and the good work of our staff, uh, this wouldn't have been possible, but today we have a very safe connection and a pedestrian connection all the way from where people live to where they need to walk and go to school. Let's check this sidewalk out.